Dante's Boxing Nation out here with the super middleweight champion Badu Jack. Gonna be fighting James Aguil January 14th. How does it feel, man? Great, finally. You know, they've been talking about us for six months or more. So finally they got it done and I'm ready. You ready? Yeah. How do you see the fight playing out? I know it's early, but I mean how do you fight a fighter like James Aguil? He switches back and forth. You know, he's going to try to box. He's going to try to do a little bit of, I guess, both inside out. You're going to try to apply. Well, you always apply a lot of pressure, so we kind of know that's what you got to plan in store, right? That's a way to see fight night. Yeah, that's what it is, man. And that makes you the unified champion, the only one left in the super middleweight division is on what, Hilberto Ramirez, right? You have. Yeah, I think uh, the WBA as well, so. That's right. That's I right. I think it's Felix Stern. Is it Felix Stern? Oh, he tested positive. I don't know. Uh -huh. Russian dude. They got regular super belt. I don't know. What did you think about um, the girl's last performance? Oh, so so. Uh, Porky Medina is a tough guy. He's hard to fight. I fought him. I knocked yeah. him out, but he's very strong. He's tough. I know he, he was gonna have a tough fight. Uh huh. That's a, and that's the same guy that actually knocked out the um uh, Jay Leon Love, right? Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Now you also said. Not jumping the gun, but we might as well talk about it. You, you also said you wanted Gennady Golovkin, you know, assuming you get past James DeGale. I, I, I'm just curious, how would you fight Gennady Golovkin if you had a fight with him? I don't know. Right now, just focusing on James DeGale. Uh -huh. What I said, somebody asked me, what what fight will make you, if if you can't fight DeGale, if that fight's not going to happen, what's the biggest fight? At Super Middle, I said, there's really no big fight. Unless Triple G moves up, that's what I said. Okay. So I'm, okay. I'm willing to fight him if, if he moves up, but from what I heard, he's not going to move up yet. So. Yeah, yeah. He, he just yeah. recently said that he could make 160 okay. easy, so he probably won't. Okay, and before I let you go, I just want to ask you about some trending news real quick. What do you think about um, Danny Garcia going up against Keith Thurman? How does that fight play out? Oh, that's a very good fight. Yeah. Very, very good fight. I don't know. I mean, Thurman got good movements. He, he got some pop, too. Danny Garcia, he's an underrated fighter, you know, it, it, kind of like myself, it looks easy from the outside, but he find a way to win, you know. Uh-huh. So, yeah. yeah, that's a good fight. 